So this is Oblivion. I've expect, expected more nothing. It's I think I got confused with hell. To another location. No shit. Well, let's find out where we are. A few moments ago, we were in Kingdom Valley in the ruins Nevertheless. of some old castle, and now we're in the ruins of some old building in... Who is he? A world that's just gone and exploded. Why did everything become... M monochrome? I don't know why it did that. I'm in. It's a I've ramp thing to do. Location. It's... Why does this computer work? Everything else is just... No, well, you know what everything else is. Not possible. We're still in the doctor's base, but how can that be? Still, we weren't there in the There's first no place. Now. So, it's not where we are. I never noticed that screw up. Was there at least supposed to be teleport here the from the doctor's base like time. Tales and Sonic and Knuckles? Doesn't it? Yes. Approximately 200 years. Maybe more, depending on when this database was last updated. Well, at least we know we've arrived in the future. That means this Mephilus character has the power to control time. His power feels very similar to my own chaos control. But... Oh, just another day. <laughs> Case in point. See, you can just fall from great heights and not be killed. Rouge didn't need saving. Boy, do I feel dizzy. Where are we? I like the reflection on that glass. That's a really nice touch. I didn't expect to see you guys. Rouge! Shadow! Hi. Long time no see. Uh, like I said, plot progression. Kind of. This is the distant future far removed from our own timeline. The future? How do we learn that was removed from our own timeline? Then that means Eggman's machine can control time! Eggman's got some nerve dropping us here. Now, how can we get back to our own time? You need a space-time rift, but this requires a lot of energy. Evidently not, considering how many times it's being used in this I see. game. You mean using your chaos control will? Yes, but that alone is insufficient. Dramatic. Okay, zone. Shadow. It looks like we need to work together. You know, there's one glitch that I've seen a couple of people do here that I've never actually done myself. But I kind of want to try it. It results in me getting killed, but that's kind of the whole point. Okay, so today, instead of mashing A, we're going to be mashing the X button. With A button thrown there every once in a while. Hooray. Well, how do we find a working car? And, okay. That was a fun car ride. Oh god, the lag. This is much easier than being on a uh, snowboard thing. I would say. Go die. You're in my way. Very nice. So I'll chug to take care of these guys. Man, these guys are easy. I'm sure there's some kind of in between with, uh, the purple and red 
ableist things. So they won't be just pathetically easy to kill or really annoyingly hard. And that is some awesome collisions. Okay, so it's something like Iron Blight is it's like doing a home attack where I did where I did right there, except sometimes it'll just kill you. Like it'll just teleport you through the ground or something. I think this is where you do it too. Maybe wrong. I thought this is where you do it though. What just happened? My homie deck just did nothing. What? Get out of my way. I thought that was where it was. I'm pretty sure it was. That's where it was actually. I guess I just missed it. Having not done it right there. Whatever. Hooray. I can live with this. Yeah, I'm not wasting my time with you guys. What kind of roads? And why is this still standing? Well, this is a different transition Sonic had. Slightly, but same place, just different. So nothing too terribly interesting. You know, I don't find that there's really a point to using Chaos Spear of the Shadow, uh, as demonstrated on the top control demonstration thing. Because you can just homie attack enemies to kill, them in, to kill them right away, or uh, throw a couple pu uh, punches and kicks at them. Oh! Wow. To damage them further and kill them. Okay, so note to self, don't try to jump to that rail. Okay, looks looks like we'll have hit those, but I guess not. Very nice. Why am I on the side there? Uh, this isn't as cool when, uh, uh, when you've already done Sonic. And we've already been in the place with uh, Silver, too. It really is. I do like this place, though. I will I will say, I, it's one of the more crappily designed areas in terms of actual gameplay, I feel. When it comes to, like, playability. I was trying to do a light dash, but it didn't really work out for me. I'm not gonna help me attack those guys. There are a couple. Whoa, no. A couple general areas where things just screw up in this level, I feel. Yeah, Shadow's homie attack's just too far. No, she can't let down your guard in a place like this. Uh, that, there are just lots of little hiccups in the actual gameplay of this area that I think takes away from. So I can't get. I can't grab those rings. Takes away from what uh, it really could be. It's not. Doesn't stop it from being a decent level in the first place, though. Whoa! I was all surprised I didn't. Uh, don't have me attack towards that rail. That's not where I am. Don't throw away from me. I like all the homie attack platforming here, but I, I feel it's kind of overdone. And I just stuttered. Alright, it gets. And it's already obvious in the first place that. Uh, ah, indeed. In the first place, that. Or the way that the enemy's positioned already makes it really blatant uh, that they're set up 
for you to be able to hit them a certain sequence to get to a certain place, which isn't always sequence can always be followed because those shadows is long ass homing attack range. But oh, what? How, how did I get this? Why? Ow. You don't just find these things in a waste. You don't just find these things in a post-apocalyptic wasteland. But anyways. Um, crap, I think I remember what, exactly what it was I was saying. Um, okay. Okay. Th that was fun. Crap. Why is it all the one-ups? Holy crap. No, it's interesting that they have the exact same technology today as they did 200 years ago. Or more. Now. Everything's just floating. Awesome. Oh yeah, but uh, about the enemies being the homing attack platforming. But they have it so much, uh, enemies being lined up like that, that it just kind of gets... It's all that feels too artificial. I mean, it's artificial in the first place, you can tell, but it does, it's not as bad. It's kind of hard to explain. What's over there? What's this? Oh my god. Why? I had 117 rings, you bastard. Oh, cool. I guess. That's not really do much for me. Alright. What the hell? That, did, that accomplished nothing. I'm always one up, so I'm not complaining. Alright, I can screw around more. Uh, I can die more, but. So many. Ow. I don't want these. Why? That's what I'm doing. Screw you, I'm going up here. Well, I could at least have some fancy animation when I went through those things, like in Sonic Heroes. I like that. I always like going through those rings, purely because of that, not even just because I like, skip part of the level, or like a small section. <laughs> just fell over. Shadow's homing attack is just so odd, I mean, such a long range, and being able to, uh, just kick off of essentially anything. I want to go over there. Jerk! It's like a max of the maximum amount of rings you can drop when you get hit, that's really annoying. Can I get out? Why do you need nine year Oh god. Okay. I just moved in midair. I I am rising upside down. Look at it, dude. You can you can tell how big that is. For a cycle, it's actually not that large, I don't think. I guess for a second of fire it's not terrifying, but how how what how do I have momentum? I guess you could say it's like Shadow's Rocket Skate things. Onwards! Okay, I was trying to hit those birds, but... Alright. Oh, that's all you. No. Oh. Do we really have to be recycling voice clips like that? It's just kind of... Oh, 
Okay. Just kind of lazy feeling. One ups. I, they're just everywhere. They're not even hard to get or anything. You only have to go out of your way. Boop. Yes. I guess B? That was all right. Yeah, B. Ah. Man, the range for. The range for some of the ranks are just huge. The range, the range is. So since I, didn't, since I didn't really show any glitch, uh, there at, well, actually, no, I assumed that I was going to be returning, the ta returning, the, returning to the town now, but actually I have another level and a boss fight to do, so never mind. I still need some kind of boss <laughs> fight, though. My precious chaos emerald. And we apparently found a chaos beautiful. emerald. Your mysterious brilliance. Omega! Omega? What's he doing here? It seems he's in standby mode. What you figure that out by to messing around with the wires? Don't he just have like a little light on his back? Yes, this is Rouge. Understood. We'll be there in a minute. It huh? looks like Sonic and his friends have found something too. Let's go. How did they communicate with you like it's that? Like we can do anything for on your non existent glove thing. Yeah. How did Omega just not get destroyed? So yeah, the whole plot. Something that I find interesting in Shadow Story is that it, chronologically it's all out of order you in terms of so when Shadow experiences Love. things, along with the player. A chaos emerald. Because he's experiencing at numerous points, well, you uh, experience the I results of something that you do in the future. Unlike a certain echidna, I know. What? <laughs> I like the reference to that. I think I already said that last time, sock story, but still. Have you guys discovered anything? Um, yeah. I received a signal indicating there's a chaos emerald here, but you mean on what? You, you just carry around there? a tracker with you? If you don't like it, you can stay here. You've got to be kidding. Don't be late. Same to you. Hmm. Not sure what I'm doing for this episode's glitch. I only have five minutes. Crap. I can get through this level in five minutes. Probably have more like six or seven minutes, actually. But still, I'm not going I could get through that quickly, maybe. I don't know. Maybe, I guess this will just be a longer episode for you guys. And I didn't pick up those rings. Awesome. Script events. There's apparently a silver metal there. This is some high speed venturing. I can't fall off here. Oh, I I can fall down. God, well if I fall off I can just jump right back on. Looks like I can use that monster to move ahead. I can use that monster to move ahead, that's a really weird phrase. Man, the, those are some long invisibility frames. More one ups. Yeah. Boom. Yeah, just don't miss that. I hit that dead on, too. Yes, generally touching fire is a bad thing, though. They keep transforming us.
Ah, it's kind of a pain sometimes just how long Shadow's uh, homing attack is because you just don't have much control when it comes to doing it, actually using it for platforming or to extend the job. Using it while platforming that is. Oh, hello. I'm not using Silver's, so I can't just kind of cheat my way up here. Screw all of you. I think you do. I'm not sure. I think you may get to increase damage while you're uh, all pissed off. I don't think your spear does anything else, though. That took too much of anything. But, oh yeah, I forgot. You actually do uh, like splash damage. You have a really wide range sometimes. You're, I think it's increased, but it's not really all that obvious when you're lower level. Hmm. I'm not entirely sure, but I think that is the way it is. Oh, it's purple one. These are. No, I didn't seem to do any extra damage there. I'm not sure. Oh yeah, I'm definitely doing. No, I'm not. I think I did all that much damage last time, actually. I attacked one that I wasn't in Chaos Boost. So I'm not sure. Oh, holy crap! You, I can do that. I didn't realize that. I didn't even press anything, I just... did it. I just teleport through enemies. I don't know if that was like a predetermined sequence that I, would, that I did that on, or... Why didn't I bounce? Holy crap. Okay, Shadow, just kill things and get rings. You jump further than it seems, so... Don't underestimate how far you can jump. Especially when you're playing as Shadow and I really... I did I could just jump on top of that thing and jump up. I didn't need that spring. Hello. I think it only works. I think the whole like teleport thing only works for one hit enemies. I can maybe I'll just go here. Maybe too far away. I'm not sure. How it works entirely. Okay. Yeah, it seems that. Yeah, I think it's like predetermined paths or something. Uh, and shadows levels that you're allowed to take if you do, do how many attacks on enemies while. Uh, yeah, see, I get. I, Oh my god, the thing flew. I would have done it there. See, I think they're like predetermined paths that you can take. Uh, you can take while in Chaos Boost in Shadows episodes. Or episode. Yeah, he gets such vertical range too when it so many attacks. Seriously? Oh god. I just uh, and risking falling down here so I didn't just do a home attack straight to it. Alright. Shadow, why, why don't you just randomly say that while in the air? That's just rude. Company doesn't like it when you make those sounds. I don't really like it when you teleport into them and smash their faces in, but that's beside the point. I don't really, you, you are the visitor here. I don't tell you about your own will, but... No, no more chaos boost. You really can last a good while if you're just... Oh man, I almost got up there. You can just kill enemies. You know, I have a feeling I could actually just jump over there. I want to try, actually. 
I threw some up here. Oh, awesome. I could go onto that rail, but I really do just want to try jumping over there. You can just want to make it. Wow! What the hell? Can't help yourself. Don't only attack things beneath you. Or don't attempt. Do not attempt. Go die. What the hell? I kicked through him. I said I want to take an all path. I'm just gonna kill these guys. When I'm on you from kicking. I didn't pick up the energy. Crap. You know, that springer is not pointing where it sent me. What the heck? Oh, it's okay. Can I just like touch it? No, I, I can't even kill enemies by touching them. I just don't get hurt. That sucks. Such for how rare it is. And how short it is too. What the hell's the point? I shall be able to do that. Don't screw you, I'm just jumping down. These lines of these things have to have been inspired by xenomorphs. Did I seriously just do a homie attack onto the ground? They look so much like them if you actually stop looking at their uh, ridiculous just flailing everywhere. And uh look at their shape. Check out the heads. I mean, this is a general shape in the first place, but yeah, look here. You can see them pretty well right here. And then there's the head shape. Head shape is most definitely in a more flag. Hello? Let's have to kill these things. Which will apparently shoot fire. Oh, I just kicked that fire. Like a boss. Crap. Oh, crap. I don't have any... ...access to rings. No. Shit! Hey, not that rings are really a problem, but... Seriously, I'm only back here. I'm unhappy. Is there any more laser things? See, that's something that an alien movie needs. Xenomorphs with lasers. I could get behind that. Okay, so there's more than one door here. I guess let's just take the other door. I shouldn't have to hook around while I do a homing attack like that. That's just... Uh... There we go. See, I, I had a suit that was able to go through that other door. It didn't take up that much time, that area. I want to kick off those stalactites. I think I'm going to stalactite. Stalactites, like if you use stalactites and stalactites. I like it. Occasionally, they rise and they just forget again. Yep. Shut up, you're not far off on anything. Shut up. So much for light dash. Oh, oh, this is Shep. Uh, this is Knuckles section. So, hooray, right, I can actually finish a level as Rouge just like you have the Shadow. I'm gonna do that, because I don't want to go through this section. So, you actually have to, like, pick up all the balls of light or something like that. Just in the spirit of bugging out the game, even though it's not going to be a new glitch. It's also one of the worst areas for getting it, for stopping yourself from. St not always stopping yourself, but the walls here are some of the worst walls in the game when it comes to sticking. It's a huge pain. 
What's the key of sticking to walls, actually? Shadow does, Symes does that. I'll have to show you sometime. I can never remember to do so. This one level, uh, uh, I'll probably remember to do something, but there's also another glitch I'm doing that level already that I have planned out. What? Oh, I got through through the door. Whoops, I did not pick up my rings. I kind of like this glitch with that with Knuckles is so conveniently placed that you can actually finish a level with Knuckles. Um, it's, the only, it's the only place it allows you to do something you normally can't do as that being finishing a level as Knuckles. Alright, so be careful because I've actually shown this before, but you can't actually grab any of the walls, so... Seriously. Oh, they just exploded. Let's listen to Rouge talk like Shadow. Be fun. Why did I bounce upward up there? When I jumped straight up right there, it was actually not my own doing. What? Okay, that 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 out. That would sound weird, weird with Shadow, too. Oh. Awesome. Aw. <laughs> well, there's the new glitch. How can I call myself a treasure hunter? Awesome. I was wondering what would happen there. I was wondering if it would like, send me back to the checkpoint or something. Anyways, that's it for today's episode of Let's Play Sonic 06. See you tomorrow. Or, not tomorrow. Whenever uh, the hell you watch the next video. Bye, everybody.